Here we are at Thriving Communities with Jerome Laxal, who is the Mayor of the City of Ryde. Thank you for joining us this evening. It's great to be here, Lexi. What a fantastic event. It is awesome. I mean, you've got a room full of community members, you've got businesses, you've got really passionate, um, I guess, community advocates such as yourself. It's really great to see the City of Ryde sponsoring such an event. Why, why choose this one? There's so much out there. Why do you guys get behind an event like this? Well, you said uh, you've got such a eclectic mix and I guess that's what makes it so unique uh, here in the city. And it's right on the border of Ryde and Epping as well, uh, which gives us another dimension. But City of Ryde supports events like these uh, just as we support others because our, I guess, main purpose is to bring the community together. And we often find that when uh, people from different sectors, people from business and the social sector or even you know elected officials and, and um, uh, people from government organisations, when they get together, um, sometimes magic happens. You know, I know that sounds pretty up in the air, but uh, you get um, a community organisation that bumps into the social coordinator at the City of Ryde. And, you know, as we heard tonight, they provided them with a facility for Christian Community Aid, which has been going for 50 years. You know, the same could happen with a community organisation and a business or a community organisation and a bank. Um, and sponsoring events like this bring people together and that's, you know, particularly uh, something that I'm very passionate about uh, as Mayor of the City. And that's what uh, that's what's so great as well. It's very difficult to get people in the room, and as a politician, you'll know it's hard to put several people who are important and have a, a, a shared interest in the room at the same time. This is what Stefan's managed to achieve with thriving communities. Um, what sort of connections does the City of Ryde hope to make when you guys come along to events like this? You've got so many departments here. You know, you've got economic development, you've got the communities, um, you've got you know across the space. You're really trying to have a presence. So, what does this achieve for you as a council? with connecting with your local community? Well, our main role is to serve the community. And those who are here, like our staff that are here today, we're really trying to let people know about what we do and how we can support them. It's really hard, like, you know, particularly from uh, my perspective, we have these great ideas. They get into policy and they become a program, a, a way of assisting people. And people don't know about it. Yeah, the cut so, through. Yeah, it's they, very yeah, the difficult. The cut through is hard. So we've got the library team here today talking about the wonderful programs that we offer there and the facilities that our residents and and local businesses and community groups can use. Uh, we've got our business um, development manager here, Jan Bahali, who's working really well uh, with a lot of businesses here. Um, and we've got a really important community engagement program going on at the moment for uh, Ride Central, which is a proposed redevelopment of the Civic Centre. Huge amount of community space uh, remains um, owned by council. So yeah, we've got uh, a vested interest in being here, mainly because we want to serve our local community, be they um, people who are in run-for-profits or be they our local business community or just, you know, anyone who's here off the street today. That's fantastic. So thank you for, for being part of it, for being a sponsor, for making it a free catered event. Not very op many opportunities for small business to have those. If you haven't found out about this event, one way you can connect with the City of Ride Council and you don't need to be a business here. You can connect with them and get on their mailing list and find out about all the fantastic programs that the economic development team run. Uh, there's great networking events. I have to say, Mayor, that your city is, is in the area, probably something you should be very proud of when it comes to the economic development team. They run great events. They're well organised. They've got great speakers. Um, so hats off to you for that. It's uh, I was something I would say that other areas... No, in, thank you. In, and look, that's, that's really good feedback because with Macquarie Park, we've got, you know, it's the eighth largest economy in New South Wales, second largest... Um, no, sorry, eighth largest in Australia, second largest in New South Wales. We want to make sure that we have a competitive advantage over other cities uh, that are close by. And that's why we invest in, um, we're a founding investor in Venture Cafe. And for your listeners of this podcast, please look up Venture Cafe Sydney. This is a global organisation that's chosen the City of Ryde to set up in, their first ever in Australia. And they, very much like tonight, they bring entrepreneurs together, businesses, not only Macquarie Park, but across Sydney together, uh, to share ideas and to have those, what do they call them? Serendipitous collisions, I think they call them. <laughs> that I have not heard yet. <laughs> no, I might no, have to work that into conversation that. on the show. It sounds pretty good. So um, come along every Thursday night, a couple of hours. Uh, there's free drinks there too and free catering. So there's a bit of a theme going on here. But we want Macquarie Park and the City of Ride to be the centre of innovation and connection and um, that's why we're so happy to support events just like this. Well, it sounds to me like thriving communities and all the great things you've got on for the small business community is a great start. Thank you for joining us here on Small Biz Matters. We hope to bring you on the program at length. You can talk more about the fantastic work your economic development team does and all the support mechanisms you have in place. You've been listening to Small Biz Matters. We're live on the floor of the Thriving Communities event and we hope to see everyone again next year.